What's going on, y'all? I'm doing a little bit of foraging for lunch, AKA dinner. I kind of decided what I'm gonna actually do is do some looking around downtown and see what I can find fragrance-wise. So I'm gonna let y'all get into this thing with me, okay? My man Keith over at The Fragrant Life challenged me to go ahead and look around in the rack store and see what I can find for the Lolo. If you guys are into that type of content, stick around, because we're gonna get into that thing. Y'all know why y'all came? Y'all know why y'all here? We about to get into that thing. Let's go. Every single day, I'm gonna make something great. That's my way. Every single day, I'm gonna make something great. That's my, that's my way. We gotta do it slyly so we don't get found out. Cause a lot of people don't like you recording their store. I appreciate y'all hanging in there with me. We're gonna give it a try downtown to see what we can get into. I'm about to go to some of the rack stores out here, see what I can find in Chicago. Cause I always see my man Keith over at the Fragrant Life, always finding great things in the Southern states. We're gonna see what we can find. I'll let you guys know. Keep you abreast of what's happening. What's going on as I tour the city. I don't come downtown that much anymore because I'm working remote and whatnot. That's the best part. It's a little bit of adventure for me and for y'all. For everybody that's not venturing outside the most, let me do it for you. Let's see what we can find at the rack stores. Stuff is still pretty boarded up down here. And partially I think the reason is because of they're afraid of you know who gonna riot because you know who didn't win the presidency. I don't know. But it's beautiful downtown, it's quiet. It's cleaner than I've ever seen it. That's the most interesting thing. So, I'll let you guys get a visual as I pass on by. People being so goddamn nosy. Forgive. See that? Boarded up the shit. Ghetto. That is ghetto. Don't shoot the message is all I'm saying. Famous State Street. We're gonna go into Ross and TJ Maxx to see what we can find. If we got time, we actually gonna go to Burlington too, so. You know we ain't finding no deals up in no damn Macy's. So we ain't gonna even try that one. That's where we had it, y'all. So we are entering Ross and we see a good deal of the staple type of fragrances that you find in Ross. Nautica Voyage, some Perialis, Guess, some of the Adidas fragrances. Nothing really that I'm really interested in adding to my collection. We see some Perialis, more Nautica some Lacoste, some Beverly Hills Polo Club, Hugo Boss, but nothing really of note. We gotta move on from here. It's not gonna work. It's a no for me. Absolute fucking trash, as usual. <laughs> We're gonna check out Nordstrom Rack to see what's going on. I entered Nordstrom Rack halfway thinking we're gonna find possibly some gems here. I found at least three or four different fragrances that I've added to my collection that were at a decent price at Nordstrom Rack. So I'm actually excited to see what they got going on. Okay, okay, the selection here is admittedly better. Of course, Nautica. We see some see some Dolce & Gabbana, see some Kenneth Cole, I see some Jean-Paul Gaultier, 
see some Burberry Brit, see some Kenneth Cole. You know, not bad. Better selection. But I will say, admittedly, these prices, uh, they leave a little bit to be desired. We got some gift sets over here, some things that I've never, ever seen. Some Tommy Bahama, Harajuku Lovers, Oscar De La Renta. Gift sets again, some polo. We got Yope, one of my favorites. See some cool water. Let's see some Vince Camuto, CK1, but the Versace Mano Fresh called by for $35 for a one ounce. Not featuring that at all like complete fresh. I didn't even get a chance to get no damn lunch. I'm mad about that, but you know what? All for the hunter fragrance, I'll sacrifice a little meal. Trust me, I'll be all right. I've had enough meals to last me for a lifetime. <laughs> Let's see what we found. Out of the frying pan and into the fire. I came into this TJ Maxx and I don't even know what I was really expecting at all. A lot of the fragrances are locked up behind glass, which kind of throws me off. But again, it's more of the same. Tommy Bahama. Ooh, hair out the way. Tommy Bahama, Nautica, Gas, Hugo Boss. I see Polo Red. I think I see Aqua Amara in there. CK into you. Eh. Okay, so we actually did find some good sell care products. Yeah. Let's see what we find. And Burlington. Their fragrance section is more of the same. Nautica is always in abundant supply. One thing I keep seeing is this guest noir. And I even saw a clean fragrance the first time ever. We scored some self care products and a decent price fragrance that I haven't heard of. Uncommon scent. So we're gonna let y'all know what that is real soon. Stay tuned.